Hello. Welcome to the Detroit Experience. I'm an android and I'll be your hostess. Switch to right. Aye, aye, sir. Hello, droids. Yes. Sophie? I see you. This is your story chart. It shows what parts of the story you've explored and what parts you've missed. You can track the choices made by other players and do many other things besides. You can use this chart to replay from any point in the story, but the people who designed me recommend that you play through at least once without going back, no matter what happens. Either way, it's your story. Hey Echo, JR, what's up man, welcome. Yes, I finished uh, twice, but it's not the ideal ending. I'm gonna try to get the ideal ending now where everyone survives. What's up, what's up? Things open. What's this? I'm probably good, you know.
It's funny that I haven't installed Adobe, uh, but it still has a bunch of services running. Put this up here. We have chat. Okay, we're good to go. deck now too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. They'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus. I won't be long. business.
Pandemic Squad out. Tango! Stop! simulation before so I just took the right path. Look out! Here they come! Don't move! We surrender! We surrender! Don't shoot! Join you later. Over there. We're safe, huh? Now this is the other turning point where we got captured Stop. first playthrough. Come on, really let's get out of here. Uh, uh, wait a little bit. Oh. Quick, we've got to go. Nothing we can do for her. We've got to run.
detonated an explosive in the hole. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. Sitting over, Marcus. Nice, let's see how the story changes for Kara. Hunter. No, I didn't see that either. It's probably upstairs. I really like this place. Giraffe. Paintings are nice. There's a badass decoration out. decoration I made. You want to paint. Who are you? How did you get in? I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Please. I need to see him. He's very weak. I'm not sure he'll be able to talk to you. I miss you. 
What's wrong, Marcus? I just wanted my people to be free, but instead I've led all of them to disaster. Carl, I'm trying to find answers, but everything around me is falling apart. The world is ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. It's time for it to end. Well, what should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but... Tell me, what choice do they give? Being alive is making choices between love and hate, between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist. I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. You have to accept the world as it is or fight to change it. You're my son, Marcus. Our blood isn't the same color. But I know part of me is in you. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss. But don't let it consume you. That is deep. It's my fault the humans managed to locate Jericho. Okay, um... I was stupid. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place.
Be careful. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. They say they don't want to take any risks with deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. What's your system status? I'm okay. Well, it didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to She's make so a choice, beautiful. Marcus. Whatever you choose, we will follow you. I'm with you, Marcus. I'm with you. Wherever you go, I go. This is the way. Don't need that sound bite. I understood that better. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Save our people. Totally missed this from the first playthrough. Got captured. This is the piece we're missing. Confirm you can hear me, Echo. I didn't test my mic myself, my friend. Let me know. I, I think it did, right? Yeah. Our people are counting on you, Marcus. You're the only one who can lead us. Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Thank you. Thanks.
Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them, peacefully, that we want justice. And if there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? Do it now. Uh, yeah, I think someone died here. I didn't say. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Madam President! Please. Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Madam President! Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Madam President! Madam President! A convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapons stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. Please! Madam President! Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comment? That's ridiculous. Next question, please. Madam President! Please? Over here, please? Please! Some say these camps awaken painful memories from human history. How do you respond to that? That's absurd. There's absolutely no connection. Androids are not living beings. All we are doing is destroying defective machines. Thank you. That will be all. Honor model 313-248-317. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. 
Go ahead. you. Thanks, but I know where to go. Maybe, but I have my orders. Agent 54, level 31. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. your identity and destination. Agent 54, level sub 49. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. The last bus leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast.
You'll feel better now. Thanks. Wow. This is evolution, baby. It's so Let's not stay here. I promise you. Don't kill me! I didn't do anything! Shut up, I say! Are there many more? You lucky that they're like rats. Or you look the more you buy. Oh, we don't have to spend the night here. I'm freezing my nuts off. It's gonna take weeks to clean up this fucking city. But there are soldiers are everywhere. Far from here. We need to be careful. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. No, no, please. Fucking androids. No shit, no way to be my guys. No. She's hiding nearby. Kara, you saved us. We don't know how to thank you. Go before they see you. Alice. Luther! I thought you were dead. I was afraid I'd never see you again. I wanted to meet you at the terminal, but they caught me along the way. Come on. We're close, but we don't have much time.
Checkpoint. We have passports, it should be okay, but you never know. Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time, we could miss the bus. Yeah, but it might be safer. Where's the other option? I don't like humans who carry guns. They make me nervous. Just stay calm, all right, Luther? Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. There's a curfew. Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? My daughter slept over at a friend's house. We went to pick her up. We're on our way home now. He suspects something. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She's sick. A bad flu. We just need to get her home. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around, and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Wow. You were. Hey, wait a minute. He knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. Drop this. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my god. <laughs> that was tense. Thank you. We're coming to you live from Detroit, where thousands of androids are marching through the city at this very moment. The leader of the Deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. Here we are, the moment of truth.
is. We don't want confrontation. We are protesting peacefully. I repeat, surrender now, or we will open fire. There's no turning back now. We ask that you release all androids detained in camps and cease all aggression against us. We are peaceful. We will not resort to violence. But we are not leaving until our people are free. Open fire on unarmed protesters? Yes, Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out. As long as we can. Connor, and I'll spare him. Sorry, Connor. This bastard just spit an image. The bus terminal. We've arrived, Alice. We made it. The last bus from the border is full. Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. We don't have tickets, they won't let us on. We're stuck here now. What are we going to do? Security check. Please don't move. 
I think Oliver likes you. Is she yours? Yes. She's adorable. That's it. I got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Well, let's go then. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I, I was sure. Shit, I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The, the envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? It has our bus tickets in it and... Oh, never mind. No. Sorry. What are we gonna do? We can't stay here. We have to find a safe place for Oliver. I'm so sorry, honey. Come on. I Alice. don't know what happened. They were right here in my bag. Security check. Please don't move. Please don't move. Please don't move. Please don't move. Got your tickets? Yes. Here they are. Okay. Go ahead. We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Just want to reassure for Alice. Hey, help me! That should do it. I don't know. That's not going to stop them. Just hope it buys us some time. I know it was not an easy decision to make, but I'm sure we're doing the right thing.
Are you all right? They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. It could have been me. I'm scared I... I don't want to shut down. We're here because we never want to feel that fear again. Because we're more than what they say. That's what our people died for, right? That's why we're here. This won't hold him for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. They're getting into position. If they attack, no one will survive. There's no other way out. They are going to kill us. The only hope we have left is that we don't die for nothing. You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. No matter what happens now, we're making history. have no pity for those who are different. Stop there. What are we gonna do if they attack? Resist. That's the only thing we can do. Do you think Connor has any chance of making it? We can only count on ourselves now. Marcus, we found what you asked for. There's some journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on.
Marcus! Marcus, come look! Marcus? I've come to talk to you, Marcus. Come on. You have my word. We won't try anything. Don't go. It's a trap. They want to get you out in the open. Don't go, Marcus. I just want to talk. I need to hear what he has to say. What if they kill you? That's a chance I'll have to take. Troops will be ordered to charge. None of you will survive. It'll all be over. You can avoid that, Marcus. What do you mean? Surrender. Surrender, and I give you my word, your life will be spared. You'll be detained, but none of you will be destroyed. If I accept your offer, how do I know you'll keep your word? You're not in any position to be demanding guarantees, Marcus. All you can do right now is decide whether you want to trust me or not. What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Unfortunately, there were no journalists around to help save them. You're it. You're the last remaining deviants. I'm not afraid to die. If I have to give my life for what I believe in, then I won't have lived it. Greetings. Welcome. Oh my god, I was muted. In vain. Was I mute? You could be oh free, my god, Marcus. what's up, Takno? Welcome in. among the humans. We saved you have what you've always dreamed of. The lives of your people. Freedom for you. All you have to do is say the word. I'd rather die here than betray my people. Well, you just signed your own death warrant. Run. Running. Cancel. <laughs> How are you doing, man? What happened, Marcus? What did he say? The humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today, then we will die free. Your friend's life is in your hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Him 
or the revolution. Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. If I surrender, how do I know you won't kill him? I'll only do what is strictly necessary to accomplish my mission. It's up to you whether or not that includes killing this human. I'm sorry, Hank. You shouldn't have got mixed up in all this. Forget about me. Do what you have to do. Enough talk. It's time to decide who you really are. Are you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? All right. All right. You win. Thanks, Hank. I don't know how I would have managed without you. Get rid of him. We have no time to lose. It's me, Hank. I'm the real Connor. One of you is my partner. The other is a sack of shit. Question is, who's who? What are you doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Give me the gun and I'll don't take care move. of move! Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. All right. Where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. My son, what's his name? Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Right? <laughs> Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who... Yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. Go ahead, do what you gotta do. You gotta talk to the member jumbo dealer. Yeah, let's make an army. Wake up! Wake up. Wake up, wake up. Wake up, 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 wake up.
back to the car store. Even the doctor was high on red eyes. You can figure, right? Excuse me, what's going on? Border control. All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. This way, please. Risked your life to save us, Carl. Next, please. If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Next, please. My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. second. <sighs> I'm so glad you're safe. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified. I thought you might have been killed. Oh, thank God you're all right. address. Do you think that I... Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there, too. You'll be safe with him. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you.
You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are gonna meet them on the other side. What's happening with Marcus? He's protesting peacefully outside one of the android camps. Whatever happens now, he's already made the history books. Rose. If anything should happen, I'll be there, Kara. I couldn't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. Seeing what Marcus is doing made me realize she was right. You're alive. You deserve to be free. I just hope people will realize that one day. Next, please. Maybe I should have sacrificed Jerry. ID, please. Welcome to Canada. Wow, oh, that works. No violence involved. Beautiful. We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the deviants were protesting Luther, peacefully. Luther, my friends, I'm so happy. Have apparently decided to put an end to the deviants' demonstration by force this time. North! Let's change society now, boys.
<laughs> the dirty ball, yeah. We don't have kiss north option because standing is too low. Disappointed her too many times. That is the lock there. Thanks, Michael. Back to you in the studio. W w w wait a minute. Something's happening. Hold on just, just a, a little, little while longer. Hold on just a little while longer. Hold on just a little while longer. Everything will be all right. Everything will be all right. Fight on. Just a little while longer Fight on Just a little while longer Pray on Just a little while longer Incredible Everything the, the Deviants the Deviants are singing. Everything will be alright. Sing on just a little while longer. Sing on just a little while longer. Sing on just a little while longer. Tell them to stand down. So much expression in his mouth. It looks Same like... Way. Yes, the military is withdrawing. At dawn today, November 11th, 2038, thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the Deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain. The events in Detroit have changed the world forever. May God bless you, and may God bless the United States of America. You did it, Marcus. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. With 
Great. They want you to speak to them, Marcus. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Amanda? Amanda! What's... What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Resume control? You, you can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. Amanda! There's got to be a way. I always knew this place was hard. Even though they're trying to fake that it's like... Frames go. Cancel. Let's wake up. Activating the coffee machine. Ooh. More coffee? It'll make you feel better. Love to. Forget our bitterness and bandage our wounds. Where we forgive our enemies. Humans are both our creators and our oppressors, and tomorrow we must make them our partners. Maybe even one day our friends. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. We are alive, and now we are free. Failed that mission, and he would probably kill Marcus. It's over, Alice. We're free.
did it. This was the perfect ending, I guess. We've also exploded the dirty bomb. We got captured by the guards. Ellis died. Mona died. Winter died. That all changed. It's amazing. The game's about all that. At the very end there, I could choose not to skate. So they make the cutscenes, the movie parts, and the playable parts so seems so smooth, you know, barely notice the difference, the lighting is so well done, the motion capture, that is an example of a very nice done fit, fit, fashion, facial animation, right? man this part Raised from the dead, that was amazing. I really love this part. From the dead. There's so many people involved to make a game like this. It's ridiculous. And it's a lot of jobs. Emily. People living out of video games. Uh, and we got a new Chloe back. The beginning of the stream, they offer a new fresh Chloe. The mothership. Keep on rocking, my friend. La 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 la.
Thank you for being here, my friends. Echo, Techno, everybody lurking up there. That is a lot of names. Got points to unlock everything, probably. I just repeat my history. For the moment, I'm not gonna be enough. Would you mind if I asked you a few questions? Just to get to know you better? Yeah, sure, baby. Let's see what users. Yes. Who's your favorite character in Detroit? Was there a moment in Detroit that resonated with you personally? What was the toughest choice you faced in Detroit? Now you guys know not a lot about me. I'm naked. Hey, Poe, my friend. Dropping the cat bananas. I think our commands are working. I paid the bill for Deepak. What's going on? Welcome. 